while the horsemeat scandal has certainly been bad for many companies, including some international brands, it hasn't been bad news for everyone in the industry. Craft butchers say they've noticed an increase in customer numbers in recent times. But that's uh, increased since the issue over horse meat being passed off as beef first arose. This afternoon, RD-based butcher Peter Callahan went out to the farm of one of his suppliers. Together they inspected the animals that will soon be heading into his shop. A fourth generation butcher, his shop on the main street of the town is busy. Back in the 1980s, only four people worked here. Now they employ 18 full-time and part-time staff. Horse meat is, he says, just the latest scandal in the meat industry that's helped his business. We found that every time there was uh, some sort of a scare that would come flooding back to us. We, we do a local product here, like we are a farm to fork shop, so people realise that. In fact, Peter says his business is up close to 10% in recent weeks. And here in Ashburn, Hugh Maguire has also noticed an increase in trade. And he says it's replicated nationwide. The last two or three weeks I've seen a huge footfall increase in the doorsteps of all butcher shops. Generally speaking, the rural members that we've spoken to has been seen an increase of 10 to 12 percent. In the cities and large towns, 80 to 20 percent. There is, he says, no such thing as cheap food, and people come to the local butchers because they can trust them. I'm getting what I'm paying from, and when it says beef, I'm getting beef, and 100% sure I'm getting beef. You can see what I'm getting. I know coming here it's fresh. I know my chicken is chicken. I know my beef is beef. That's the main reason. And it's not just the horse meat issue that's helped businesses. With the recession, more and more people are not going out for dinner, but instead going to the butcher and bringing it home to cook. To back up their claim, the craft butchers point out that last November, 10 new butcher shops opened their doors for the first time in the greater Dublin area alone. Richard Delling, RT News, Ashburn.